Hi guys, um, I know I said in the last video we're going to be do, doing regular videos of, of what's going on here but it's hard, it's hard making YouTube videos. Um, you find yourself in the middle of doing something and thinking, ah, oh, I should be recording this. Um, so today, it's Saturday so I've come in to do a few parcels but what I thought I'd do is make a quick video of the warehouse, the progress we've made, switching it around from the shop to to the online side of things, give you a quick tour. Um, We've had a couple of collections brought in, so I'll show you them quickly as well, and um, see what you think. I'll switch to the GoPro, and i uh, show you around. Alright, so here we are. Here's the warehouse. Let's close the door. Now it's a bit of a mess because we're moving things around and, and getting things sorted. But, um, packing station here. So, got the computer up there. We pick the orders, printer, all very messy. Then orders, we're sticking these totes with the pick slip. Picking trolleys, this station here, this is where Leah sits and she lists everything to the system and then puts it on our racking. Um, then we have quite a simple racking system. So it's each row is a letter, A, B, C, D, E, F. Each set of racking is a numbered. So this is A2, B, C, D, E. So we know where everything is. And when we print off the picking slips, it shows us the, the location. We mostly sell sort of geeky collectibles, things like pop vinyls. People go mad for these things. T-shirts, statues, toys. Um, but when we've been buying mixed pallets from suppliers, you know, we get toys and teddy bears and mad stuffed dogs that look very, very weird. Um, so yeah, so this is where we pick everything. Um, still remnants from the shop around. We've got a display cabinet that we need to knock down so we can utilize this space here. Um, this is where we keep a lot of the toys that we, we get from the pallets and things. Some American candy. Now we've only just started buying this in just to give it a little test to see how that goes. But the problem is it's too tempting to eat it yourself. We um, had this delivered yesterday, another Paddy's pallets. So this will be a video. Hoping to record unboxing this tomorrow. We've won this at auction. Uh, I think it was about 500 quid we paid for that, so I'm looking forward to showing you guys that. More racking, boxes, not very exciting, toys, mugs, more boxes. As we we'll go further down, this is the area that we've not sorted yet. So, this is our death pile. So all this stuff still needs listing. And... Yes, it looks very messy because this room was just full of boxes and we've, we've cleared it out. We're getting it sorted. Um, we're going to get rid of the racking of the back wall here. We're going to have all the boxes down there. This section here will be full of the, the same racking that you saw in the front. So we've got tons and tons of, of pick space. Um, in here, this is going to be our sort of preparation area. So taking photos, you know, going through collections. We do mystery boxes as well sometimes, so that's where we'll kit the, the mystery boxes. Um, so we're just getting the racking put up along this back wall. All these wooden pallets will be will be gone. Um, pallets in the corner. So it's still quite a mess and still a lot of work to do. But, you know, we're getting there. Hopefully in the next two weeks we'll have everything sorted and we can just concentrate on on the buying and selling um, again more racking this is for the back room more racking here this is we put a bulkier stuff on here that's light um, so sort of plushes and drink cans things like that so, um, a lot of the people we buy from we actually do buy in bulk so we can get cheaper prices um, don't mind ha holding on to stock for a bit of time um, and then when it comes to Christmas and things like that we can 
hopefully have plenty of stock in to sell. People are talking about a shortage this year, so we'll see what happens. Um, the section here is box damage products, so pop vinyls are notoriously bad for boxes sometimes. Um, we are quite strict with pop vinyl, so it doesn't take much for us to list it as box damage. They are collector's pieces, so you know, people want them pristine boxes. Toys isn't such an issue, but we actually sell all these. Um, what we do is we, we list these on eBay as box damaged. I, mean, I can't really see the damage in that one. But it'll be there for a reason. Um, so we do still sell these, obviously, for a lot less money than, than if they're okay. Um, and that's his back. Graphic novels. Um, we buy and sell graphic novels. People bring them in all the time. Um, now, we're not open to the public, but we allow people to come in with collections and things like that they want to sell. Um, we just had these come in yesterday, which we purchased. Um, action figures, Street Fighter, Ryu action figures. Uh, World of Warcraft. This figure looks really cool, but looking online, Surprisingly, it doesn't go for that much money. Um, a few broken ones. More Street Fighter figures. Now these, if they were boxed, I don't know if you can see that. If they were boxed, they were probably worth about 50, 60 quid each. Um, there's more Street Fighter figures. Thundercats, these are pretty cool. Um, now, I paid quite a lot for these. Um, I think we paid 90 quid for them all. And the reason why we did that, the guy that we bought them for works for a storage and removals company and quite often he gets people who've left behind comics, books, collectibles and things like that. So although I've paid a bit more than what I'd like for this, hopefully in the future you know, he's going to bring in more stuff and that's where we'll make our money back on that. And that's it. That's the warehouse. Um, like I say, over the next week or two, we'll be moving things around a bit more, getting organised, and then focus on, on buying and selling and getting stuff on the website. So thanks very much for watching. Um, our next video is going to be an unboxing of the Paddy's Palette, which is there. I know a lot of you guys saw the last video, um, so we'll see how that goes. I've got this one, and I've got another two coming next week. I've won two of their auctions, and... Um, I bought one off the website, I can't remember which one I bought off the website. So, you know, over the next week, so all them will, will get uploaded. Um, thanks you guys for watching. Um, if you want to keep following the journey, give us a give us a like and subscribe. And um, hopefully we'll be a bit sooner get the next video up. Thank you.